After a judge rejected a plea deal a month ago, that judge accepted one today. That included a stunning change. Steve Markey's family did not expect. Markey was killed in 2019, and today prosecutors replaced the charge of second-degree murder with attempted assault. But as Fox 9's Karen Scullin tells us, the family doesn't blame the judge, but is highly critical of Hennepin County Attorney Mary Moriarty. Obviously, that's an outcome that our family is very upset about. It isn't commensurate for the crime. It was a total shock for murder victim Steve Markey's family as a second-degree murder charge was knocked down today to attempted assault for now 20-year-old Hussein Braveheart. Frankly, from our perspective, this is a political decision by Mary Moriarty. Steve Markey was killed in June of 2019. Then 15-year-old Hussein Braveheart and 17-year-old Jared Osman both fired at him. But it was Osman's bullet that prosecutors say killed him. Osman is serving 20 years. Braveheart is done with incarceration for this crime at four and a half years because of credit for time served. What it is is it's an end run around the legislative system and the sentencing guidelines. We're very disappointed. I just want to say that I'm concerned for everybody else's kids. I mean, if you can just kill somebody and kind of get out of jail free, um, what message does that send to other teenagers? The judge today had a similar take in court saying, I am concerned about the message you're receiving and whether that will lead to more harm by you or others in the city. The judge also said, I have great concern as to whether the system is doing you a service or disservice. He said he couldn't legally reject this plea because the charge was changed by prosecutors and the sentence then fit. This is a pattern of behavior. It's a violation of the victim's rights statutes. And frankly, Mary Moriarty and everyone on her team should be ashamed of themselves. Steve Markey's father did briefly stand up at today's hearing, pointing at his son and said, I hope you understand the impact you've had on this family before walking out of the courtroom. The Hennepin County Attorney's Office released this statement. Mr. Braveheart, a juvenile when he committed this terrible crime, has made enormous strides and been responsive to treatment during the past five years of his incarceration. That treatment might have prevented this crime in the first place had he received it, and we believe the treatment will prevent a future crime if it continues, which this sentence allows. As always, our heart goes out to the Markey family who suffered a terrible tragedy. Now, Braveheart would have likely been released very soon, however, he has several other criminal cases that are still working their way through the courts. In Minneapolis, Karen Scullin, Fox 9.